Good morning. Are we ready for this? Are you guys ready? Ooh, the sun is shining. On your mark, get set, go. Day two since Eric has been away. She is in Milwaukee with Dutch. They are headed to the Symphony Orchestra in Chicago this week. So she tagged along with him down there. And I'm doing her chores. It doesn't seem that cold, but it must have gotten pretty cold last night because the snow is hard again this morning. You want a cranberry? I'll give it to you if you don't bite my fingers off. You want that? Oh, gentle. Good, Tina. Yeah, oh, and Dorcas is right back here. Somebody left their shoes on the floor. Look at that. Yeah, you looking for attention? Yeah. You too, huh? So I'm making the smoothie for breakfast this morning. So far, I've got some ginger and water in the blender and I'm just blending that up. And I'm going to strain the ginger. Ooh. While that's straining, I'm going to add, see this, this is uh, kefir, double fermented kefir. Anyway. About a half a cup of that. I've strained the ginger and I'm just gonna, and my hands are clean, don't worry. Besides, I'm the one who's going to drink this. I'm just going to squeeze the rest of the juice out so I get all that ginger flavor. And I'm going to add that to my blender. And I see I have a bright window behind me, but yeah, such is luck. To this, I'm going to add a couple pinches of salt. It's just mineral salt. And I hope that's enough. And yeah, like my little salt crock, it says nutmeg. Ha! Oh. And I'm going to add some stevia. And I like it sweet. One, two, three. I like it sweet. And I also need some lemon juice, but I don't have lemon juice. So instead of real lemons, I'm using this true lemon packet and I'm using one, two, three, four, five, six of them I think because I really like this but I like it tart and it says that one packet is the equivalent of a slice of lemon. Okay, ready to go? Okay, the rest is going to have to wait. I have to take Elisa to school. So I have a car today. A sure sign that spring is on its way. Iron warship. I couldn't help it, I had to drive down closer to the iron ore ship and see it come in. It's hard to see, it's so bright out here right now. <laughs> anyway, it's back there over my shoulder. I was down here yesterday filming the ice. Sure is pretty along the lake shore. There's my shadow. That's the lake behind me. And the sun. The sun is very bright. Yeah. You see 
see the shoots going up on the dock? People there. Oh, I'm sure they're normal sized people. They just look little from here. Okay, I am back from dropping Elisa off and taking pictures of the ship coming into town. And I'm going to finish my smoothie. To all these ingredients that I already put in here, I'm going to add a quarter of an apple and about half of a cucumber. I'm gonna blend that up. Okay, I've taken the cucumber back out and I'm gonna cut it into chunks. It didn't wanna blend up that way. Round two. I am going to add some whey protein powder. You can add whatever amount you like. One more ingredient, a tablespoon of baobab powder. Yeah, you can look that up, figure out what that is yourself. The last thing I'm going to add is a bunch of ice. Mm, needs a little more salt. Just because I like my smoothies to be more like a shake, I'm gonna add some xanthan gum to thicken it up. It's pretty good. Okay, here it is. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. Not bad. Add a little more sweetener, because I really like things sweet. And just a little bit more protein powder. While I was working, I looked up, glanced out the window, and I saw huge snowflakes coming down. I just had to come out and show you. Now, back to work. Go check out the lake since we're in town. 